Sometimes people wonder why it's worth taking action to file a divorce petition rather than just let things drift and see what happens. And of course, on a human level, sometimes uh, you, you just aren't ready and so you do let things drift. But there are procedural advantages to going first. The first is about jurisdiction. In some cases, it really matters to seize the English jurisdiction. There are other jurisdictions that could be competing to have your case and getting your petition in first in England can really help secure the English jurisdiction for you. That's the first thing. The second thing is that it sort of sounds a bit boring and technical, but it can be very useful. If you are the one who first filed your financial application, which you do after or, or along with the divorce petition, then your team gets heard first. Your team presents the situation or whatever it is to the court, then the, the other side responds, and then your team pitches again, gets to come back again. So your team gets to open the case, set the, the, the picture, as it were, for the court, and then gets to close it off again. So they're the first and the last person that the judge hears. So that, that can be very valuable indeed. The third thing is once you've got an open case, you've got a framework from which to do anything urgent that happens, like an urgent application to freeze assets, an urgent application to stop something happening, to stop your spouse buying something, something like that, or also a very easy platform from which to take applications to protect you, to protect you physically and uh, look after your safety. So just having that situation live is a good framework for, from which to start your case. It, it sets you off with a, something of an advantage.